Okay, so what I kind of do is look for things that I've not done around the house. And this could be cleaning, gardening, stuff like this, bro. Washing your car. It's mm, so easy. It's still exercise. Or even washing, like helping the missus, helping your mom wash dishes. And this is what we can implement into Ramadan because we can help our family at home. So um, I really look into these kind of things. And I'm just, whenever I'm doing something, I'll try and, I'll try and like, if I'm going somewhere, just say, to get something from the house and it's on the other side of the house and it's like I need to get a few items I'll get one item I know it sounds weird I'll get one item I'll go and put it I'll go, I'll go back and get another item I'll go up the stairs climb get another item and stuff like that that's just moving it's mm. keeping me moving keeping me feeling active it's making me feel good and that's why like even gardening and stuff like that I really enjoy doing it because it's keeping me active and it's keeping my mind occupied rather than because right now I'm like, well I've not got work so like training is a big thing for me that's why like I train about twice a day if I can I go for my walks and that's what I do to keep myself fit and healthy as much as I can during this time because it's difficult being in a house all the time and there's stuff around you and for me specifically bro I've got a shop so I live uh on top of a shop so like I've got food oh, at man. my in front of my face bro so i can get chocolate if i want to i can get crisp if i want to i can get fizzy drink if i want to but i know these things don't make me feel good these things are not going to benefit my body not just from a look how it looks but how it feels and then that again cons- kind of has an effect on worship and i can't worship bro like genuine generally like i can't genuinely i don't feel good when i eat certain foods and um, it affects me when i'm praying like you know what that reminds me of? There's a um, saying by one of the one of the scholars or one of the I don't know if it was a companion. Um, I'll try and find it somewhere, uh, or if anyone yeah. in the comment section finds it, let us know. But one of the um, I think one of like the classical scholars mentioned, he said something like, "I noticed that the times I would sin the most will be when my belly is full." Basically, to say. That when you're fulfilling your desire of your stomach, it's then easy to fulfill. You start getting in this cycle of, oh, I fulfilled one desire. Let me fulfill another desire. Let me fulfill. And you become weak to your desires. Whereas if you can if you can be strict in your desire for food, you can be strict in your desire for, for, for other desires. Um, 